Do y'all ever try to get a thumbnail with three dogs before? No, I stole the cheese. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There is cheese everywhere and there's dog slobber everywhere. Hey you guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I obviously have three special guests helping me out with this video. I saw this going around the internet and I thought this is like the perfect video for me to do. It's been a little hectic thus far. Are they having fun? They got a lot of cheese, so I, d I don't really think they care what they're doing. <laughs> I first saw this video done by Jenna Marbles. She did Dogs Pick My Makeup. I'm not entirely sure who started it, but I will do some research and uh, put that in the down bar, of course. One thing I want to do differently, I want to use pretty much brand new makeup, so makeup that I don't have an opinion on. That way, as we're going and I'm trying the makeup, it's actually going to be like a first impression at the same time, just to give you guys a little bit more content. There's, there's a poppy seed in my teeth. Fantastic. So this is Hotch. Oh, he is a little floofy little puppy. Hotch is eight years old. Um, I, I think that that's not entirely right. I think that he's a little bit younger. He was a rescue, so we don't know for sure his exact age. I was told that Hotch is a German Shepherd mix. Again, I think that he is a maybe like Border Collie German Shepherd mix. I think he looks more like a Border Collie than my other dogs. I think he will play well in this because he's quite spunky and he probably will just like to run through everything but we'll see he's a bit on the sleepy side this morning this is my sweet little mama girly um girly was a rescue with hotch they were a bonded pair so girly hi mama she is nine years old she's a little lady she's the sweetest dog on planet earth i swear i just love you you're such a good mama everybody's so tired they're like why did you wake us up so early? This is the last puppy. This is Oaks. Oaks is my youngest. He is three years old. Had him since he was a puppy. Between the three of these guys, I feel like we should be able to do this pretty well. Hey, bubs. Oaks like chin scratches. I feel like there's gonna be a lot of puppy voice in this video and Oaks is tired of it already. All right, let's get started. We're gonna do primers. So I have the Kat Von D Derma Blend, uh, the Farsali, Rose Gold Elixir, which you're gonna use as a primer, and then the Pixie Rose Flash Balm. And we're gonna get Girly to do this one. Here she comes, here she comes. Okay. So Girly has chosen the Farsali Rose Gold Elixir. Don't chew that. So the primer that was chosen is this Rose Gold Elixir. Now this is a beauty oil, but I've seen a lot of people use this as a primer. So when you open it up, there's actually like gold flecks in it. Wow, that smells nice. Maybe I'll just put it on my face. You can actually see the gold flecks, but looking after, it's almost like as I've rubbed it in, you can't really see them. It kind of smells strange. It kind of smells like orange creamsicle-y, but then I can also smell this sort of uh, chemical-y smell. It's not just oily. My skin's actually soaking it up as like hydration, so. But I asked you guys on Instagram to leave me some questions, so I thought we would answer one of those. This one comes from Rayleigh Pridmore. She asked, where do they sleep? Before we get into this, let's see what foundation they chose. Oaks, come. Wait, 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 wait. Sit. Good job. Oaks is there. I'm gonna put these treats down. Leave it. We have Giorgio Armani face fabric, It Cosmetics CC Plus Illumination, Benefit Hello Happy, and we have, wait, leave it, thank you. And then he just laid down, and then we have Bare Minerals Bare Pro. So these are his options. Okay, so look at that. He's not dumb. So if we had to rate them, I think that would be the right. For foundation, we're gonna be using the Benefit Hello Happy Soft Blur Foundation. I'm really excited to try this foundation. I, would it be a video if the dogs were not barking in the background? I'm really excited to try this foundation. I've had it for a while, but I haven't had a chance to give it a go. Mine is in the shade three, but I don't really know if that's gonna be a good shade match. I do have every shade, so if I want to pick a lighter or darker shade I can. It's a soft blur foundation. It has light to medium coverage. It's a liquid foundation, obviously, and sounds right up my alley, light to medium coverage. Okay, so shade three looks like that. Not that bad, but honestly, I feel like we could mix a little bit of shade two. Let me grab shade two. Okay, so I lightened it up a little bit. I'd rather be too light. That way we can um, bronze it up than to be too 
dark. So anyways, Oaks and Hotch sleep in bed with me. Um, Hotch, they both sleep on the left side of the bed, I sleep on the right side. Um, Hotch sleeps on the pillow and Oaks sleeps at the bottom. And then Girly, I actually have this day bed from Urban Outfitters and that's in my bedroom and she usually sleeps on that. She does like crawl into bed in the morning so like as soon as I wake up, Girly will be like, oh you're awake and then she'll crawl into bed with me so it's not that she's never in the bed, I just think probably just likes her own space. So weird when I like go on trips and sleep in a, a bed, I'm just like this is too much space. There's the foundation. What I think about it is that I love it. Um, I really like that it still shows through my freckles and that's kind of what I really want in a foundation. If you like a light to medium, which I do, I don't like full coverage foundations, then I think that you will like this and I'd go get a sample of it from Sephora for sure. Moving on, let's see what they picked for concealer. Set up a little bit of an obstacle course. We have Rimmel London, Bare Minerals, Kim Kardashian, and Too Faced. Okay, come, come. I didn't touch any of it! Hotch laid in between two of them, so I don't know. Maybe we'll pick between these two. So we have Bare Minerals and Kim Kardashian. I call Hotch Hoochie, by the way, if you guys haven't clued into that. Which one? Which one? Can you pick one? No. Oh, he does not care. I think I gotta go back to the treats, eh? We don't work for free, Mom. You can have it. All right, so I'm gonna say that means Bare Minerals is the one. I think this shade will be pretty good. This is Fair Light Warm 2. Another question comes from Stay Goldenance, and it says, who is the best cuddler? It's definitely Hotch, only because he will let you hold him while you sleep. He will let you put your arms around him and like hug him, whereas Oaks would be like, get your hands off of me. <laughs> Not really, but like, after you know a minute or two he likes to like move and have his own space let's see what they chose for powder one is by bare minerals one is by l'oreal um for uh bronzers i have the alia one and i have a clinique one who's up for the task oh okay so hotch chose the bare minerals powder so this is actually a powder foundation um mine's in the color champagne three i've been actually looking for kind of like a new powder so let's give this one a go i'm going to take it on my zoeva um 112 brush i really like this for right under your eye Ooh, that's nice when you can see the powder go on and you can see where your brush hit your face you know that that's a good powder so i've just quickly done my brows because i didn't have any new brow products i don't need anything other than giving brow um but let's go ahead and see what they chose for bronzer now we're gonna do these two okay hachi oh i don't know what that means i guess does that mean this one you tried for this one you were hope you were going for that one Changed your mind last minute? All right, so for bronzer, we're gonna do this Aaliyah MAC collab. This is pretty new. So here's what the bronzer looks like. It's got a lot of glitter and sheen to it. I'm thinking it'll be really pretty and glowy. Megan Alyssa Berry asked, describe each dog's personality. Hotch is a little bit of a troublemaker. He likes to be the center of attention. He likes to come first. Uh, but he's really spunky and has a lot of spunk and he's very playful and he's very loving. Uh, Girly is just a sweet little angel. She's so quiet. She's so well behaved. Um, she's just very loving. And Oaks is just still a puppy. So Oaks is the the youngest. So he's just a little little baby, and he just loves to play and loves to play frisbee. And you know, he's my puppy. He's my baby because he you know he still loves to play he's much younger than them and he has so much more energy so this bronzer is really pretty it's a bit like kind of sheer it has a lot of glow to it though pulling the light down a bit there you can see it a little bit better like it's really nice just gonna go in with a smaller brush i usually do this uh same bronzer and i'm just gonna deepen up kind of where my contour is how do you not cry every day about the fact that your puppers have chosen you to be their forever human? That was from Purple Power Ranger. You know what? I am so lucky to have them. I'm kind of sappy because I watched this movie on Netflix last night called Megan Levy. And uh, it's, it's based on a true story. It's about a, 
Megan Levy, who she was a canine handler during the war, and you know, she has a German Shepherd in it, so it's a little bit, <laughs> a little bit close to home. I truly mean this when I love my dogs more than anything on planet Earth. They are what keep me going every single day. They are what gets me out of bed every single day. I am so lucky to have them in my life. Like, I know that sounds a bit crazy dog person, but like, so be it that I'm crazy dog person, but they have literally changed my life. Um, they change my life every, every single day. I just am so lucky to have them a part of my home is I guess what I'm trying to say. Let's see what uh, blush they picked. We have Hotch over here picking a blush. He's not even picking, he's just picking the first treat that's closest to him. But anyways, we will do this. L'Oreal Paradise Enchanted Scented Blush. This is kind of weird, like L'Oreal put out like peach scented stuff and I'm a little confused because didn't Too Faced do that? Anywho, let's see if it actually smells like peach. Oh shoot, it does. Oh, that's really amazing smelling. Wow, I love that. Not super pigmented. I mean, there's the shade, so it's not like we're going in with something that's like super peach. Um, is it worth the money? I don't think so. It's not that pigmented, but this would be more pigmented on someone that was a little bit more fair. You know what? There's color there for sure. So if you're a little bit scared of blush, okay, yeah, go for it. Bake this contour a little. I'm just using that same Rare Minerals powder. Ooh, it's nice. Very nice, very smooth. I feel bad I put down that blush. It's really pretty. Yeah, that's pretty. Okay, you know what? I'm sorry, L'Oreal. Didn't mean to put you down. Let's do highlight. Let's see what they picked for highlight. Pick one. Pick one. Pick one. That one? Okay. KKW Beauty. Nice, we got some some dribble, some puppy dribble. I have been dying to try this since it came in the mail. KKW Beauty, it's beautiful packaging. I am gonna swatch them on my hand. Here are the shades. I think I wanna mix these two shades. I'm gonna apply with my Morphe 501. This is what I like applying uh, highlights with just cause it's so perfect for the size of my face. Then I'm gonna mix the two shades. There she is. Look at my cupid's bow, damn. Next up, let's see what they chose for an eyeshadow palette. Oh, mama. You don't want none? You want that one? Okay. Didn't really think about it. Should've put the cheese on the ground beside it. Here, yeah, okay, now all my makeup is gonna have dog slobber all over it. Okay, here. So I actually haven't given these a try yet, so I'm really excited. So it is a trio, and that is what the trio looks like. So this next question asks, do you enjoy having the breeds that you do? If you would suggest any breed, what would it be? So I had German Shepherds growing up. Sailor, my dad's German Shepherd, had a lot to do with why I wanted to get one. I think I saw the bond that him and my dad had and I really wanted that with my own dog. I got Oaks when I was living far away from home. I was like really lonely and I was like starting to get depressed and I just needed something to like get me out of bed in the morning and keep me motivated and that ended up being Oaks. I would suggest getting German Shepherds for sure but I just think that a lot of people get them as guard dogs and things like that and then they end up not knowing how to actually take care of them or they don't have the time to spend with them and I we always see like a lot of large breed dogs become very aggressive that's my biggest worry you have to be able to give them the time that they need they're high energy dogs I just think a lot of dogs are usually you know brought up to be mean or vicious dogs and they don't know how to switch that off so if you are going to get a German Shepherd, I would just be aware of that and wish I could use another palette. Like I would have wanted to start that off pretty matte, like matte all over the lid, probably, and then built up the shadow from there. When you go in with your finger and use it as a lid shade, that goes on so much nicer. Well, I'm glad I did that because I was really not into the quad or the trio. Let's see what mascara they picked. It Cosmetics YSL. Maybelline and um, L'Oreal. So I'm gonna put treats in front of Oaks. 
Okay, we have a winner. YSL Mascara Volume. We have one that's the curler and we have one that's the flash primer. So we're gonna try these both. So I'm gonna go in with this primer first by YSL. Um, create volume with the inner curve of the brush and then you lift lashes with the pink comb on the side of the brush. So there's like this top and then there's brush and then there's a side brush. Lydia Dotsia asks who is the goodest fluffiest doggo boy of them all. They all take the cake for that. We're almost done. Let's do lip product. I'm gonna call one of the dogs and I've created this landmine of lip colors. Bunch of books and ones, bunch of NYX ones. I'm gonna see whichever one they touch. Oh, 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 it didn't touch any of them. It didn't touch any of them. Are you crazy dog? Okay, you can have this one, but you still have to pick one. Good boy. Still got pick one. Anybody? Oh, oh, that one. That's the one. That's the one. Okay. So this is called Heat Wave. So this looks like a fluorescent orange. Oh, holy shit. Look at that. Oh my god. The dog's actually got like a color thing going on here. I'm pretty impressed. Okay. Oh my goodness. All right. Let's check in with what setting spray they chose. Tatcha, Smashbox, Dermablend, and we have MAC. What treat you want? Do you pick one? Look how close he is to that one, but didn't eat it. You want cheese slices? You want cheese slices? Yes. You want cheese slices? Abum. You don't want these stupid cookies. You want cheese slices? Yes, we want cheese slices. Do you eat that? Do you eat it? Do you eat it? You eat it? Okay, this one. So this is really cool. Matt came out with a pink version of this and a gold version of this. And basically it's fixed plus, except it has like this gold in it. And when you shake it like that, it sounds like a spray paint can. I want to just spray this on my hand and see. That's beautiful. Isn't that nice? Yes, look at that. That gives you like that Jamie Genevieve glowiness. Yes. I also asked Girly about what, if I should add like a lip gloss. Girl, which one? One of those two, I think. One of these two, right? What one? That one. Good girl. So yeah, she said to add Ariana on top of this, which is like a gold, which could be kind of cool. Ooh. Girly, that is so good. So my dogs are gonna start their own makeup Instagram coming spring 2019. Good job puppies, thank you for all your help. I'm gonna take these puppers for a big W-A-L-K because they were so good. Look at this look you created. You are a master of makeup. Yeah, wake you up. You're always sleeping. You're always sleeping. Okay, say thank you for watching our video. Time for bed. Bye. Goodbye. Good day. Where's Gerbs? Girly is sleeping, so I don't want to wake her. This was really fun. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go clean up the cheese on my floor now. Bye, guys. You are good puppies. Oaks Hotch Girly MUA 2019. Watch for it.